Hello, welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. My name is Katie and I mostly do subscription box unboxings here, so makeup, skincare, that type of stuff, but definitely some other things. Mix it up a little bit, so if that's piqued your interest, definitely check out some of my other videos if you feel like it. You can also come back on Sundays and Wednesdays because that's when I try to post and see what's going on. Thanks for being here now. You know, either way. What's going on now? What do we have now? What are you here for? It is the Facery 7 Lux. Lux, yeah, 7 Lux sheet mask subscription. I consider it a classic. It was here in the beginning. I think it will be here till the end. It's a good one, in my opinion. Do you do end up with a lot of sheet masks, though? So be prepared. This is a monthly sheet mask subscription. You get seven sheet masks a month. It's $19.95. They do have a pretty extensive rewards program, so if you review items, you can get points, like 100 points and then more if you add a picture or a video. So it's pretty easy to reach the point where you can get $10 off a of subscription, so just keep that in mind. This doesn't have to be $20 if you like reviewing items, which I do. I love writing a review, so... It's pretty easy for me to get this at a discount, which I love. I love that they reward people for adding to the community of reviewing. It also helps because I try to be honest with my reviews. Do y'all? Maybe I'm inclined to be a little bit more positive than I should be, but that's who I am. That's who I am. Let's get the items out and let's see what we've got this month. I left something in there. I left something in there. All right. First up, we've got the pamphlet. So the pamphlets are really, really helpful. They include spoilers if you don't want to see like the images of sheet masks, but uh, they include little pictures of the sheet masks and explanations of why everything's good and useful, the ingredients, and I really like that. I find them helpful if a sheet mask is weird or like different. They also like, hey, this one has mesh lining or two sides or something. So they always explain if something is different than normal, but usually it's just a sheet mask. Um, they also tell you the retail price, so they're pretty transparent with the value of the box, which I love. You don't have to go searching for stuff. I also really like these little pictures they have because I cut them out and glue them into my bullet journal slash daily planner. So that's what it was like. Oh, that's what I did that day is I did that, that sheet mask. And it looks like I've accomplished something because it's a bright, pretty image, right? It's helpful. So that's also something I like about these because I can just, it's something for me to cut out. It's a craft, and who doesn't love that, right? So let's get into the actual contents of the bag. First up, we have the Oats My Banana Sheet Mask. This is from Face3. This is one of their new ones. I'm super excited to get this because I, they released it and I wanted it, but I held off because I knew I would probably be getting it in my subscriptions, and then I did. So really excited about this. Let's read about it. Let's see why I'm excited, right? This is a sheet mask for plump, soft, and glowing skin. Yes. This is a banana fiber sheet mask, which is why I'm excited. Love trying new fibers. Who doesn't? Who doesn't love a fiber? Enriched with a 10% oat extract to help soothe irritation and redness. This is based off of their best-selling Calming Glow Weightless Facial Oil. Check it out if you're interested in that. And uh, need they say more? No, but I will. This has a Vena Sativa oat extract in it, like they said, 10%, which is a calming ingredient that helps minimize redness and irritation while also moisturizing the skin. It also evens out skin tone and brightens complexions. Super exciting. This retails for $3 USD. Happy to have a chance to try it. I spilt water all over my pants. That's okay. We move forward. We move on. And also, you should see what the rest of me looks like. It's fitting that that's what happens. Next up, we have... Is there a lot of order? That's okay. Who isn't? I am. This is the Mold Dream All Green Mild Mask, a calming sheet mask that supports and repairs the skin barrier, evens out skin tone, prevents premature aging, brightens darkness, smooths fine lines, minimizes skin irritations. Love it. It has a soft tin cell material and a gentle essence. Very, very exciting. Key ingredients are matocasicide, a calming ingredient that helps minimize redness and irritation, as well as Belta Alba Bark Extract. I've never used before. So exciting. Which purifies the skin, soothes blemishes, and inflammation. Retails for $3 USD. Next up we have the 
Skin 6 Canada Glacial Water Sheet Mask. Give your skin a burst of necessary hydration infused with refreshing glacial water to help revitalize your complexion and a super soothing, super comforting cellulose sheet mask material. I just like replace the word with another word. Ay, ay, ay. We notice it helps minimize redness and soothes our skin super well. It has Canadian glacial water. If you watch my, this is a repeat, I'll talk a little bit about that, a little bit about that more. But I was like wondering, like, how do they know it's Canadian? Is this made in Canada? I don't know. Hydrating, which Canadian glacial water is, a hydrating ingredient that focuses on refreshing, calming, and minimizing puffiness. It also has Centella asiatica, also known as Sika, which is a gentle yet powerful ingredient that helps calm skin irritation, speed up the healing process, and even out complexion. Very exciting. Never use Canadian glacial water, but I have used Centella Asiatica and quite like it. A note on repeats. So if you get the 7 Lux, the sheet mask one, you'll very rarely get a repeat if that's all you get. Like I've never, I think maybe once or twice, like one sheet mask or two sheet masks. I've had repeats. They're very good about sending new stuff every season. Very, very good about it. If you get the Lux Plus, if you don't know what that is, Last Sunday, I posted a video unboxing it, so check that out if you want to learn more. But that's their quarterly one. You will get repeats that for that season. Usually, I don't mind that at all, because if I'm interested, that means I have two I really like. And if I'm not, it's easier to give one away because I have two of them. So it doesn't bother me that much at all. Zero percent. But just, it might bother some people. So note, if you get both, you will get some, some repeats. But not all overlap. Not all overlap. So that retails for $3 USD. This, another overlap between the other one, just a note. I'll put a little star down below when I list the prices, which ones are overlaps, I guess. I don't know, is that helpful? I'll do it anyway, and if it's not, just ignore it. Uh, this is the Sandawa Calendula Sheet Mask, a cooling sheet mask that provides instant relief to dull, dry skin, add a bright and radiant glow to your complexion with its relaxing skin treatment. It has Calendula officinalis flower extract, which calms and relieves irritation while strengthening the skin barrier. Very exciting. I love calendula mask. We've gotten one before, but you could like see the calendula in the mask. It was like a, in there, the flowers. So I wonder if this is similar or if it just has extract. We'll see. We'll see. Next up, the third and final repeat. Oh no, the oats one. So this is a fourth repeat. Um, but the other ones are not, so only four out of the five from the box are, are repeats. This is the Let Me Skin O2 Bubble Bubble Mask. I said before, bubble masks are the most fun. They literally bubble up, and it feels so weird, and it's so fun, and I think it's like the quintessential fun sheet mask. And sheet masks are mostly for fun. They're supposed to be 18 minutes you take out of your day to do something good for yourself and nice. And this is like... A really fun version of that. So try out a bubble mask if you haven't yet. Or if you want. But I highly recommend. I highly recommend. This is a fun and relaxing sheet mask experience. It helps cleanse, refine, and refresh your skin in just a few minutes. This is a, uh, yeah, it has niacinamide in it, which is a hydrating ingredient that soothes and balances the skin. It also has gingiber officinal, aka okay, ginger, Root extract, which is a natural anti-inflammatory ingredient that helps protect and calm the skin. Very exciting. I've used the Vito Skin Bubble one, but that one was like extra cleansy. It was like purified. The bubbles will get in there and bubble up all this stuff. So this seems like a little bit more brightening. Less, I mean, it says it cleanses, but it seems a little bit, a little bit different ingredients. Excited about that. Next up, number six on the list, we have the. We put the yeah. Bonajour Bioactive Ampule Mask. This vegan sheet mask. I love that in skincare. Oh, the bubble mask retails for five dollars. FYI, and the calendula is three. If I didn't say, but like down below, down below. Uh, this is a microfiber material mask. It adheres perfectly to the skin. The ampule essence is amazingly refreshing and helps deeply nourish and vitalize the skin. It has. Uh, Selaginella lepidophilia extract, known as the resurrection plant. Ooh, I'll have to research that. Helps regenerate skin by hydrating and maintaining skin moisture for the ultimate protection against environmental factors. Great. Oh, my nails kind of match with a little. Mm. Mm. Myrothemus flaviofolia callus culture extract, an antioxidant rich ingredient that helps prevent dryness and irritation. Mm, this looks cool. Retails for $3. Yeah. 
Helps with dryness, redness, super refreshing. They say it's like a hug on your, your face. Cool, I've never had a Bonajour mask before, so always love to try a new brand. Last up, this one. I almost missed it. This one was almost stuck in the bottom of the thing because it's tiny. This is the Elmaloo Hanaro Modeling Mask. Let me make a little model. Let's see. A one-step modeling mask that doesn't require any mixing. Oh, okay, I get it. This mask is made to help smooth out texture while also addressing common skin concerns like dryness, blemishes, and hyperpigmentation. Modeling masks can be pretty messy if you have to mix it. I'm reading more because I don't know what this is. This one is amazing because it's already ready to use and feels super relaxing on the skin. It gives us a total spa vibe and our skin looks much better af after. It has kaolin, which is a clay ingredient. It helps remove impurities from the skin and excess oils. I have the, from Face 3, the pore freeze like mint kaolin clay mask and that's great, especially in the summer. So I like kaolin clay. And it also has charcoal powder. A detoxifying ingredient draws out bacteria and dirt to the surface of the skin, helping you achieve a flawless complexion. Interesting. So it feels like, you can kind of see in, in there. That's like the color of the mask. So it feels like clay. So I guess you just squeeze it out and put it on. No, it's a peel-off pack. I don't know. I will post about this on Instagram. So watch out for that when I use it because I am intrigued. This retails for... $3. Not too bad. Interesting. Very witty. Cool. Cool. They always throw in something a little funky, which I really like because it keeps you on your toes. Like, it's not just sheet mask after sheet mask. So this is the funky ingredient of the, of the pack. Exciting. And then the extra item we have is the Sandawa Camellia Healing Lip Balm. Nice. I love a lip balm. So this has camellia seed oil, which is calming and soothing, and then it also has shea butter. Nice. I have so, I have so many lip balms at this point, though. Um, if you didn't see it, I guess last Friday, the 12th, I posted a video from the Whole Foods Beauty Bags. There were a lot of lip balms in that, too, but I also told the story about why I can't open anymore. But this is enticing. This is really nice packaging. It's like hard plastic. Let's see, I'm gonna do it, just to smell it. Mm, it smells like camellia, which I personally love. It smells like a white tea to me. But here we go, you can kind of see the situation. So it's a very nice chapstick. I'm not gonna put it on because I have lipstick, but excited about how that smells. And this retails for $10 USD, expensive lip balm. We'll see if it's worth it. I will let you know. Might have to break my no more new, new lip balms packed with myself, because $10, jeez. How can it not be good? All right, so let's go through. Let's see what we've got. This was a good haul. We have the Oats My Banana from Face 3. We have the Mole Dream Mild Green, All Green Mild Mask. We have the Canadian Glacier Water Mask. That one is pretty. That one's a really, really nice. We have the Sodendawa Calendula. We have the Let Me Skin Bubbling one. The Bioactive Ampule from Bonajour. And then we have the Honoro modeling one. Lip balm on top of all that. So I think this is a great little haul. I'm really excited about all of these. I'm most excited just in my heart about the Oats My Banana one just because it's new and I love face three stuff and it, I'm excited about these ingredients. I'm also really intrigued, like most, I'm just excited to try to just see what's going on with this modeling mask. So, and then who doesn't love a lip balm? It smells great. So, there we go. Let me know, did any of these masks catch your eye? Let me know down below. Like I said, Sundays and Wednesdays, come back then. I also have an Instagram, so check that out for flat lays and things. And then if I post a bonus video, you can see there. You can also see what makeup I'm using. I don't know. It's just a fun place to hang. So check it out if that's your thing. Like this video if you feel like it. Subscribe again if, if that's where you're going. Otherwise, Sundays and Wednesdays, check it out. Thanks for being here now. Either way, no matter what you do. I hope this was helpful, and I hope you have a good day. I'll see you around. Thanks for hanging.